Welcome back to Rednecks Dirty Hands, and today we're going to pit the young guy against the old guy. We got Connor here, and his dad's SRX. Connor thinks his 800 is going to gobble that one up, but we all know those SRXs are fast, so I think Connor's in for a rude awakening. Brought it over because it needed a uh, tune-up. It wasn't running all that right. It was only on like two cylinders. Turned out it was just a fouled plug. So now that we got good plugs in there, I think the young guy's attitude's going to be fouled now. <laughs> so we'll see how many CCs it's going to take to win this race. Might only take one. We're not talking about seven or 800. We're talking about CCs. Connor Croft, he might be the quick one. Let's see what happens. All right, Connor's down there getting lined up with his MXZ 800. We're going to get him to run the 800 first, starting down there. This is the same stretch that we were running the uh, T-Cat and the Red Sled with, so same distance. They were doing 95 mile an hour, so we'll see. We'll have him run this one as well, just to get a good average. You don't have the same guy run it, so we get a good idea what the speeds are, but uh, and then we'll race. Here we go. You can see that or not. First time we were out here, he only got a 60. You might be a little happier with that. All right, he got a 68 on that. Last time we were out testing his snowmobile in a little bit different conditions, he only got a 60. So he predicted or was hoping for 70. So he's getting close. The uh, SRX, I predict a 75. So we'll see what happens. But here goes his second run. Come on, boy, fill it. Oh, dead even again, 68. If nothing, he's consistent. Nice one. All right, so we showed Connor his speed, a 68. Two in a row, not bad. Your prediction was 70, a yeah. little bit short. What's the prediction on this guy? 75. Oh, yeah. The old man sled's gonna just smoke ya. <laughs> Let's go for the first pass. We might only need one. If it gets a 75 out of the gate, you're toast. <laughs> All right, young lad's lining up with the SRX. I think he's gonna be uh, pretty thrilled with this one. He's gonna be disappointed in his. He's gonna have to sell his until daddy wants his. All right, first run. Let's see what this bad boy does. Oh, 69, one mile an hour faster. <laughs> That's not bad. <laughs> One mile an hour faster. Not as fast as I thought. But no? Faster. Yeah? So you don't think your MXZ's faster anymore? No. <laughs> this one has studs though. Oh yeah. Well you got the ice attack on yours. They help a tiny bit. Yeah. You want to do one more run and then... Right now these things are pretty even. I think we'd be uh, neck and neck on a drag race. So... One more, let's go. Well, this one I started in a different rut. Yeah. So I wasn't down to the ice already. <laughs> you just can't beat the sound of those triples though. <laughs> one more. All right, he's lined up, ready to go. Here he comes. See if we can get a 70. 69 again. That boy is consistent. <laughs> That's two for two. You were exact same twice on the MXZ. The exact same twice on the SRX. I got it. Or... Oh, sorry. 
the SX. <laughs> so, not bad. I think this one just gets better traction. Yeah. Well, I gotta say, for the difference of 100 cc's, I like the Yamaha way better. <laughs> it's got 100 less, and it's a mile an hour faster so far. Maybe we can uh, wrangle somebody up to uh, film us, and we can get a side-by-side uh, -side race going here. a pretty close one he had me off the line and i thought he was gonna beat me but at the very end choop, yamaha knows how to do it so he didn't like that so we're gonna do another one best two out of three right <laughs> all right let's go line up again Well, one for me, one for him. He's pretty happy about that. That was whatever result I'd like to see. <laughs> Not what I want to see. So we do have to have the tiebreaker. The Yamaha should come through. I won't let your dad down. <laughs> so one more. We'll see what happens. Well, kind of disappointed with that. I'm sorry, Mike. I uh, let you down. Your boy uh, dusted me on that one, the last two. I say it's because we were just spinning like crazy. I could watch him drive away while I was still spinning, but uh, he was spinning too, so he was just spinning better than I was, I guess. <laughs> so, spinning faster. It's spinning faster, yeah. Young kids, they know it all, and uh, they're better than us old guys, I guess. So... Uh, Thanks for tuning in, <laughs> hit the subscribe button, yeah, turn the notification bell on, and uh, leave a comment if you want. The old uh, 700 still moves pretty good. I mean, compared to an 800 Skidoo, I mean, it's apples and oranges, you know. The quality of a good 700 keeps up to the whatever. <laughs> so, I think he should sell that and take over his dad's snowmobile because you just can't beat a fine Yamaha. <laughs> don't don't let him have it, Mike. He'll wreck it. All right, take her easy.